am so excited to be testing this new piece of gym equipment. I have not felt the burn in my bottom since I worked in LA and we had this amazing bottom machine that we tested in a gym here. So basically, this is such a simple piece of equipment. It is a step, they really cleverly put holes underneath, which means that you can attach a resistance band underneath. And where it's so clever, is it's working the opposite muscle to what you would use if you were using traditional weights to do squats. Let me show you. So first of all, you do have to put your foot on the step or you're going to step backwards. If you come into a low squat and then place the bar onto your shoulder, then power all the way up so you can straighten your legs. Think about bringing your shoulders forward and engaging your core as well. So you're not going to feel the work going down here. Get as low as you can so you've got that full range of motion and then squeeze your glutes as you come up. So basically this is literally working the reverse muscle and that is the one that you want. If you want to get that kind of Kardashian look of the LA bottom, that everyone's having surgery right now, aren't they? You don't need to have surgery. This machine is absolutely amazing. So you can put different bands on it to change the resistance. I've got the lightest one right now and I can definitely, definitely feel that going back. So if that feels easy, when you've got good at that, come and place your foot right in the middle of the step and take a step backwards. So it's unstable, which means that you're working your core. It's great for your balance muscles. When you think about tilting your hip underneath, Elbows back here, drop that knee to the floor, and then squeeze your glute and you'll way back. So I can really feel that wobble. You have to work to keep the bar straight, and you're working against the band on the way up. I can so feel that in my back bottom cheek. And it's all about that lift. If you work at a desk, you do lots of driving. It's your glutes that kind of get flabby as you get older. They tend to drop down, can cause lower back pain. This is seriously, seriously going to tighten them up. So come back into the middle to change leg. You do have to make sure that you've got that weight evenly and take that step back here. Hips go forward. So you've really got that stretch in your hip flexor. And really think about driving up through that front heel and squeezing your back bottom cheek as you come up. Careful as you come down. So both feet together. Bend your knees to get low to get the resistance out of it. Three sets of those, and you're seriously going to notice the difference in your bottom.